सो हेलो एवरी वन वी आर डूइंग द फोर्थ मैथ लैब एक्टिविटी फॉर क्लास नाइन्थ इट इज क्वाड्रिलेटरल फॉर्म बाय जॉइनिंग मिड पॉइंट्स ऑफ अ क्वाड्रिलेटरल द एम ऑफ द एक्टिविटी इज टू शो दैट द क्वाड्रिलेटरल फॉर्म बाय जॉइनिंग द मिड पॉइंट्स ऑफ द एडजेंट साइड ऑफ अ क्वाड्रिलेटरल इज अ पैरलोग्राम द प्री अक्वाइड नॉलेज इज द कॉन्सेप्ट ऑफ फाइंडिंग द मिड पॉइंट ऑफ अ लाइन सेगमेंट बाय पेपर फोल्डिंग एंड द प्रॉपर्टीज ऑफ अ पैरलोग्राम the material required pen pencil origami sheets fevicol or any other adhesive ruler and the scissors so let me demonstrate the procedure to you now so i have drawn any irregular quadrilateral just a four sided figure and i uh, cut it out i i'll draw two of them uh, let me cut them out so i have got two identical quadrilaterals uh, that have been cut out now what i do is i'll just join the edges of the the vertices of the quadrilateral and i obtain the midpoints so this is one midpoint this is the second midpoint this is the third midpoint and finally the fourth midpoint okay so i have obtained the midpoints of the quadrilateral i paste the quadrilateral on this uh, origami sheet again i just uh, mark the vertices as a b c and d so just let me mark the midpoints i just found them out by the paper folding method so these are the midpoints that i have found i label them as e f g and h now i'll join the midpoints to get the quadrilateral i join e f f g g h and e h so i have joined the uh, midpoints exactly same thing i'll be doing with the second quadrilateral that i have so i have done the same thing with the second quadrilateral also and now what is the next step to be done i am going to cut out this quadrilateral obtained by joining the midpoints so this is the figure i have got after cutting out so this is the this is the same quadrilateral exactly same that i have got after cutting it out from uh, the midpoints now let me join uh, so that means this is point e f g and h point so what i do is i join f and h point so one of the diagonals i'll join so i join f h over here now i'll cut along fh and obtain two triangles so i'm just cutting it along this diagonal and you can see that i have got two triangles now so if i place one triangle over the other you can see that it completely superimposes the other one so that means that this diagonal has divided the quadrilateral obtained into two congruent triangles and what is this property is it not the property of a parallelogram that the diagonal divides the parallelogram into two congruent triangles that means that the quadrilateral that was formed by joining the midpoints of the quadrilateral is a parallelogram so hence efgh is a parallelogram let us see the pasting work now in the figure 1 we have uh, first pasted the quadrilateral abcd then we have found out its midpoints by the paper folding method and after that we have joined the midpoints efg and h to get the quadrilateral efgh in the figure 2 we have uh, cut out this quadrilateral formed efgh and joined one of the diagonals fh in the third figure we have cut out uh, the quadrilateral obtained through fh such that we obtain two triangles and i have pasted the triangle ehf first 
and on top of that I have pasted triangle GFH and I see that the triangle GFH completely superimposes triangle EHF. So the observation is that we observe that the two triangles overlap each other and hence they are congruent to each other. If in a quadrilateral two triangles cover each other completely along any diagonal then the quadrilateral is a parallelogram we already know about this thus the quadrilateral EFGH is a parallelogram. So the conclusion is we conclude that the quadrilaterals formed by joining the midpoints of the adjacent sides of a, of a quadrilateral is a parallelogram. So I hope the activity is clear to you. Watch the video again to understand better. Thank you so much.